Hey guys, RC here, back with Draft Day Sports Pro Football Season 5, Episode 4. We're finishing up this season. Episode might run a little long just because we'll probably have playoffs to deal with. And we are dealing with uh, quite a few contract extensions. I had already started recording, so we've, we're one week in. I'll go back and show the ga that game here in a second. But uh, right now, I had to stop recording for something. So just going to pick it up here. We're going through our contract uh, information. Uh, so let's see. He is rotation... He wanted more lucrative, so let's raise him to. Let's raise him to that. All right. All right, Winston Fagan. More money. Making three hundred thousand as tight end. He has started four games. Speed hands. His blocking. So he's a pass catching tight end. I don't want to pay him a ton. All right, well, we'll go with that. Because I think that's more than I offered him before. All right, Mr. Reuter. I seem to recall I offered him... South of 200,000, uh, 2 million, south of 2 million. I do like him, though. I think he could develop. Um, I don't want to pay him a bunch. Yeah, I, you know, I don't remember what exactly I offered him, but I don't want to pay him much more than that. And Tuttle, the length of the deal. Hmm. All right, Tuttle is a center. He's actually starting, I believe. No, he hasn't started. So 300,000. So let's drop it to three years and submit that. Maybe he'll like that. All right, let's go ahead and jump back in here. All right, so we beat Carolina 24 to 3. Uh, taking a quick look at the box scores, Dak was 21 of 31, uh, 272 yards, and uh, two touchdowns. Elliott, 93 yards on the ground with a touchdown. Cooper, nine carries, a buck 54, and a score to lead all receivers. All right, we're into uh, week 14. Let's go ahead and uh, play the Bengals. 37 to 12. I don't have my headphones on, so I'm not sure what that was. I heard something. Must be from my other computer. Uh, 37 to 12. We go to 11 and 2. Dak Prescott, 11, let's see, 21 out of 34, 241 yards, two scores. Elliott, 88 yards and a touchdown. And Cooper, 7 for 103 and two scores. What a game. We are playing very well. All right, 15 emails. All right, we'll delete that, delete that. Not ready. All right, Anthony Brown signs. Randy Ship signs. That's good. All right, Herndon at corner. I mean, again, I offered him what he what the game told me he was asking for, so that's ridiculous. All right, Reuter signs good. Tuttle not ready. All right. Back to the drawing board here, I suppose. No. 
Elliot. Elliot. All right, three million dollars. Let's do that. All right, Herndon. All right, let's see if we think he could be a starter. Herndon, Herndon. Somewhere. There he is, cornerback. Uh, he's got speed. He's a fifth round pick and he wants to be more than a backup. He hasn't played. Maybe he could be our, our nickelback. All right. So if we put him at rotation, he could be a nickelback. I don't even know if he'll get there. He's not even on the freaking roster right now. All right, John Scott, more money. John Scott, guard, pass blocking, strength, no starts, more money. One, two, one. I think that's as far as I'm going to go with him. Eric Doyle, more than a rotational player. Doyle's the receiver, I believe, right? There he is. Come on. 25 catches out of 43. Five drops. And what's it say his deal is? More than, more than rotational. Well, I don't think I could do that. Nah, you're not that good, and you're not going to be one of our top two guys. So we'll go that route, and then that'll be the last offer to him. And this guy, I think we really have to sign him. See, it's got to, you know, there ought to be a button on here that takes you to the offer screen. That would be the easiest thing, like, go to offer, you know, negotiate, click, takes you to the con, you know, to the contract negotiation and tells you what your last offer was. I shouldn't have to memorize that or write everything down. That's ridiculous. All right. So I think we do want to re-sign him. So that was defensive end Jackson. All right, I'm going to make him a starter, and we will pay him 2.31 for four years. Or it ought to give you, you know, it ought to give you something, you know, in the range of what he what he wants. I mean, because the numbers the game's giving us is not realistic whatsoever. All right, team news. All right, we've got probable, doubtful, oh, two two guard, two tackles, three tackles that are possibly out. Ouch. All right, we're playing Pittsburgh. I hate Pittsburgh. 
I respect the hell out of them, but boy, they kept they kept Dallas from being the team of the seventies. And it's like as good as we were in the seventies, we're just completely overlooked as one of the greatest teams, I think, in the history of the NFL. Twenty to thirteen. How you like that? Twelve and two, baby. Uh well, their their quarterback threw for 375. Prescott 22 out of 36, 299 and a score. Only 64 yards rushing for Elliott. Ship, seven catches. Cooper, 126 yards. We must have had a defensive. Look at Ryan Shazier. Way to go. Uh, no, there were just no touchdowns in this game. Four for four on field goals. Nice. All right. So let's take a gander at the standings first of all. 12 and 2, two game advantage. I think we have, let's see, 12, 14. Yeah, there's two games left. We play Philly next. They have beaten us. So if we if they beat us again and then we end up tied, like somehow we lose to Washington, they could win the division. All right, but let's take a look at playoffs. All right, so we're 12 and 2. Even at 12 and 4, we're going to be in the wild card. So we've clinched a wild card. That's good. All right, emails. All right, Amari Cooper signs, Fagan signs, all right, Tuttle's gone, you're gone, you're gone, you're gone, and he signs, so that's good. All right, everybody else I'm going to let walk. If they haven't signed by now, they're all back up, so I'm not going to lose sleep over it. Uh, and just out of curiosity, so we're at 88 million on new contracts. So Collins, I hope, signs. Uh, Gallup, we're letting go. Ship is our new number two. Elliot, I am hopeful, resigns. Doyle's going to walk. Well, hmm. I'll give him one more crack. But no, you're not a starter, dude. Well, I'll lie to that shit. Yeah, okay. But I'll, and I'll give you 890 as a starter. And then I'm going to lie to you. Because you're not a starter. Jackass. <laughs> uh, Jelks Trinidad... Yeah, he's not a very good blocker. Herndon. I do like him, but again, he's he's not even on the he's not even a starter. I'm gonna call you a prospect and offer you the million and you either take it or leave it. Scott, Tuttle, Walters. Yep, everybody else can go jump in the lake. All right, Philadelphia. This is a big game. I mean, we're in the wild card already, but we'd like to win the division. And Philly already beat us once this year. Oh, and we beat, we crush them on the road, 35 to 13. 28 first half points. Prescott goes for 337, 18 of 23, three touchdowns. Reuter, 7 of 8 with a touchdown. Elliott breaks the century mark with a score. Good job. Oh, Cooper and uh, Oliphant, that might be a career day for him. 109 yards, a touchdown, two touchdowns for Cooper, one for Gallup. Very nice, very nice. All right. So, emails. Yeah. Well, we may lose Elliot. 
Doyle signs. I lied to him. Uh, nope, nope. All right. Uh, let's. God dog it. Elliot. Fourteen hundred yards. I wonder if he's going to get fourteen hundred this year. This will be the first year he does not. Second year in a row, double di or you know, with double digit touchdowns. All right. It's fame three eight three. Key player. We'll do that. Check our team news down here, injuries. All right, so we've lost Gathers for the rest of the regular season. Lawrence is out one to two weeks with hamstring injuries. That's going to be bad. Ow. All right. Redskins, how are they playing? Six and nine. Okay. Hello, hello, show games, there we, oh, there we are, 52 to 10, that's going out with a bang, 277 yards, three touchdowns for Prescott, oh, look at the, look at the chunk plays, Randy Ship, Elliott, Elliott, oh, that's huge, 70 yards from Reuter, nice, 17 of 24, 277 and 3, 6 of 10, a buck 60. Elliot goes for 112. Ah, uh, he misses 1,400 yards by 15 yards. Ow. I wonder if the postseason will count towards that. Might. It might. Cooper, 5 for 90. Ship got the two touchdowns. Gallup and Elliot picked up one as well. Mike Glennon, player of the week. Obviously a game because Mike Glennon sucks in real life, right? <laughs> All right, let's see what happened here. All right, Lyle Collins signs, Ezekiel signs. All right, so we're done with contracts. Let's see what that does to our... Oh, man, we're right against the salary cap, I think. I don't know what the salary cap is, to be fair. Um, it doesn't tell me anywhere. Cat, quit that. I got a cat climbing up on the inside of my blinds. Jesus. Um, finances. Yes, a hundred million dollars. We may have to release some players. We may have to like waive some uh, some of our start some of our players under contract. We may have to release them. And I don't I don't think those should be guaranteed. Not if they're realistic. All right. Well, let's see. Uh, number one scoring offense, thirty point six points a game. Number one yards per game. The only offense over 400, that's nice, 296.9, second in passing, and rushing, we are 14th at 109. On the defensive side, the number one scoring defense, number two yards defense, number two against the pass, and number 16 against the run. Okay. Well, let's get to it. We're only 19 minutes in. It could be worse. Uh... So, but like I said, a little bit longer. All right, so we've got the Saints and the Lions, Eagles, Rams, Bills, Steelers, Titans, Broncos in the divisional rounds. Uh, so let's go ahead and simulate the week. Uh, Saints edge the Lions. Rams beat the Eagles. Broncos get past the Titans by four. And the Steelers edge the Bills. So we'll have the Steelers, Jets, and Broncos, Texans. All right, is he taking you? All right, time to get off. All right, see you tonight.
Saints, Buccaneers, and we'll get the Rams. Let's check the matchup. Uh, we're 3-0 and versus the Rams all time. Nice. Number one offense against the number 10 defense, or number 20 defense in the league. Uh, number one in yardage against number 27. Number 14 rushing against number 23. And number two passing against number 27. That does not bode well for them. We do have one email. All right, that's the weekly. All right. Man, let's not be a one and done. 24 to 9, yes. Solid win, solid win. Let's see. Prescott, 17 of 21, 164. Two touchdowns. Elliott goes for 105. Watson for 55. Cooper, five catches. Oliphant and Fagan, the two tight ends, team up with uh, touchdowns. And kicking three for three on extra points and perfect one for one on field goals from 40 plus. Good deal. All right, so in the NFC title game, Buccaneers, Cowboys. Buccaneers beat the Saints 35 21. Texan Steelers. Oh my God, could we have an all Texas Super Bowl? Oh, Texan fans would go ape shit. <laughs> Texan fans would lose their freaking minds. All right. Team News gathers the tight hamstring. He is probable. So I think we're good. 48 to 13, and the Steelers beat the Texans 35 21. And what's that? The fifth time in NFL history the Cowboys and Steelers are going to square off in a Super Bowl. 48-13, 20, 27-yard interception return. Nice. Prescott, Prescott, Prescott. Three first-half touchdowns. Reuter with two, two fourth-quarter touchdowns. Jameis Winston is still there. Prescott, 17 of 22, 231, three touchdowns. Five touchdowns passing as a team. 102 yards for Elliott. Doyle, wow. Six catches for 40 yards and three touchdowns. Boy, he's celebrating that new contract, eh? Man, ship. I don't know. I'm going to I'm gonna have to look at Doyle and maybe I won't, didn't lie to him. <laughs> I don't know. All right, uh, let's see. Divisional round, Melvin Gordon. All right. So, Steelers and Cowboys. Could we win our first Super Bowl? If we do, do we go out on top and go over to that college uh, uh, let's play? Again, you guys let me know in the comments below. Stick with the pros. Keep going. Or transition over and move to uh, to a college uh, uh, series. Uh, I don't even own the college game, so I'll have to buy it if you guys want to see that. Um, I could do bowl bound. I could even try to find my copy of the college years, but I mean, we just assume use a recent game, right? I mean, you know, those two games are 2005, so you know they're 11 year, you know, well, five. They're 14 years old, almost 15 at this point. So, all right, well, let's get to it for all the marbles. Oh, no, I hate the fucking Steelers. <laughs> 10 to 3 at the half. They blew it open in the third, and looks like we just couldn't stop them in the second half. No, oh, that's brutal. Six first downs for the game. Two for 12 on third down. 
No turnovers. Oh, man. I mean, Prescott, not the greatest game, 13 of 21, but 279, two touchdowns. We could not run the ball. Elliott got stonewalled, 2.2 yards a carry, and they averaged five and a half yards a carry between their two backs. Oh, man. Damn it. Damn. I don't know how the. I don't. It doesn't sort by position. And it doesn't sort by team. I mean, if we look at Prescott, 4,200 yards, 2,900 yards, more than double the touchdowns of Miami's quarterback. So I don't know if this is in any particular order. The names are not in, in order. They should not have that many people up for the freaking award in the first place. Um, so, yeah, I'm just going to leave it. Um, looks like none of our guys are going to get it. That's fine. You know, I don't vote in that thing. Uh, the Pro Bowl. Prescott. Elliott. Zach Martin, Flores, the center, Oliphant at tight end, Amari Cooper, dislocated finger, Chubb on defense, Collins on defense, Byron Jones, Boswell the kicker, nice. And 20 to 14 AFC victory. Congratulations to the Steelers, our first Super Bowl here in our five seasons. So that was nice. And uh, let's see, final stats, I suppose. Team statistics. There it is. There it is. All right, Prescott. 4,200 yards, 28 touchdowns, 13 interceptions. Elliott, thir oh, it did not, playoffs did not count, so that's regular season only. So 1,385 yards, 14 scores. We're going to have 88 catches for Cooper, 1,485 yards for Cooper, nine touchdowns, all led the team. Uh, let's see, Doyle, 29, 450, I mean, Ship. Ship broke a thousand yards and had eight touchdowns. Yeah, Doyle Doyle had four and three of them came in at one game, right? All right, kicking. I'm probably gonna have to make a decision on our uh, our reserve kicker this year, the one that we drafted. Because again, I don't think I'm gonna have any luxury room to carry anybody. Uh, and defense, 94 tackles for Chubb, seven interceptions for Denmark. He's turning out to be a, a very good player. Undrafted. Oh, I signed him as a uh, free agent, didn't I? Don't remember. If you remember, let me know. I think we signed him as a free agent. Pretty sure. 99% sure. Uh, anyway, seven interceptions. 11 sacks for Demarcus Lawrence. Jackson, six sacks, second on the team. I think we did a good thing signing him. Uh, da, 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 and other, 
anything good in there. Nah. Six penalties, if that's the worst for the whole season, I'm thinking we're pretty good. All right, guys. Well, thank you for another season. Hit that like button for me. Subscribe to the channel if you're new or you haven't done it yet. I do appreciate that. Again, those of you watching this series in the comments right now, if you made it this far, do I stick with this save or do we switch over to a college save? Up to you. Up to you. Um, if we do a college save, just to toss this out there, just like my football manager save, I, I like to do journeyman saves. I like to start with a lower end team uh, and try to build my way up. And, you know, so we would be we would be talking multiple seasons, uh, you know, as a career um, and seeing if we could work or either move our team up to where we were competing on the national level or getting promoted uh, to higher tier jobs uh, along the way. So let me know what you guys think. Uh, I do read all the comments. I do try to reply to all the comments if there's anything to reply to. And uh, hey, we'll see you guys next time, whether it's here or uh, on the College Gridiron. Thank you very much. Have a good one. Bye.